quarantines. My name's Thandra, and this is my twin brother, Pierce. What's up, my bad brothers and sisters? And today, we're going to be talking about the spookiest season called Halloween. Hold on, Pierce. We missed that. That was like a month ago. Oh, you're right. Well, 2020 has been such a spooky year with the coronavirus and all that. And it feels like Halloween all year around. Well, this episode is all about Christmas, that holly jolly time of the year. Is it that when Jesus was born? You are absolutely right. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go, y'all! Okay, guys, we are now here in our living room, and behind us is the Christmas tree that we assembled earlier. And over here, we have the ornaments and the lighting to decorate the tree. The tree in its current state is kind of like a coloring book waiting to be colored. So without any further ado, let's get coloring. Decorations. Sounds good to me. Ain't nothing like a hot cup of joe. Ain't that right, Tedra? Agreed. Now that we've set up the Christmas tree, I would like to take a moment to address a very important topic. Hey, sound man, can you please bring out the music for a sec? This is very important. Tedra? Christmas isn't only about receiving gifts. It's also about giving back to families in your community who are less fortunate. Especially in the year of COVID-19, where things are economically harder for everyone. So, we suggest that you all go through your clothes, footwear, toys, etc., and look for things that you may have outgrown. Upon doing so, you have now collected things to give to the needy. And we have a bag of things right here that we're gonna give away. Ask your parents to help you sort out the items and to find a good place in your locality to deliver the goodies. Such as the Salvation Army, Marla's House of Hope, and Dorothy Menzies Children's Home, to name a few. Ah, <sighs> it's starting to feel like Christmas again. Yeah, if only there was snow in Belize. Snow! Well, everyone, that's going to be it for episode three. Thanks for watching. We would like to give a shout out to our cousin Susan, our baby brother Nathan, our friends from school, our grandmas and grandpas, and some famous people, like the prime minister and the director, our father, Richard Holder. You better keep that part in. Bye, everybody. Merry Christmas. Have a happy new year. And see you all in 2021. Stay safe, my people. 